Picked up our trail. Hold on. That must be the home of the droid. <laughs> the fellow's land is peopled by men of straw. Said. Maybe I should disguise myself. Spirit, you have finally come. Days ago, a passing cloud foretold your arrival with droplets of sun-scented rain. But what form of being are you beneath this guise of horse and bone? From the realm of the Fae? I know you cannot say. I, I press no more. Whatever you be, now you are here, the ritual may begin. Oh, but the men of straw must announce you with sparks. Ignite the sky to begin anew, here at the death of the season. Until then, I await you, giving thanks in the glen. Halwyn said that the Wickermen must announce me with fire. Perhaps I should set them ablaze. Wickerman speaks. Now let them speak in chorus. Yes, another joins the throng. Threat. 
doing, Sunan? Another! Let there be cacophony! One more! One more! The stagger is placed upside down. Druid. Speak to me, O oh wind. I've come to ask you a single question. Something about your demeanor and your physical manifestation now gives me pause. Are you truly a spirit of light? I am a spirit as any other. Then prove it. You must know the depths of the world's mysteries before I will help you. Tell me the proper use of charms. Very well. Ask your riddles. Man and woman are made of earth, of water, and wind. Which charm clods the earth, dries the water, and stills the wind? Give me a measure of time. Are you a spirit of darkness? If it be not so, come back and try anew. What are these things he's asking me? There must be trinkets around his house that will help. A hangman's noose, a knife, and the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. Sabrina watches me from the water below. Perhaps you will speak to the spirit of the Mary Luid. This symbol is one I've seen carved into shields and headstones. He may not speak to Eivor, but perhaps you will speak to the spirit of the Mary Luid. Their mouths are open, like they've been screaming secrets.
Two ladles carved from a single branch. The grooves match. speak to Eivor, but perhaps he will speak to the spirit of the Mary Luid. Speak to me, O oh wind! Have you found yourself? If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Man and woman are made of earth, of water, and wind. Which charm clods the earth, dries the water, and stills the wind? Threefold death stops life's wind, returns a body to earth, and renders water into poison. Threefold death is the charm. Which is the charm that weds souls? The charm of the double spoon. Yes. Such that a wedded pair can sup broth together. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? The skull soul's charm summons voices from death's realm. In such fashion, I speak to druids long dead. But of course, you, a spirit, would know that. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to your question. This herb pouch made its way to Gloucester in the hands of a strange man. Do you know it? Aye. A mix to help him sleep. I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuth Lodron. Kuth Lodron? <clears throat> Very well. I thank you, Halwyn. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Ladron. Strange name. Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby. See modern ahead. Modron, well met. Guards, someone save me. A murderous Dane is here to sever my head from my neck. You could have told me of your plight earlier. We are both friends of Bridget, and I know you would do nothing to jeopardize your friend. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much. But I had no quarrel with Thefter. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Lodron, name of Gwilim. He was drinking with Thefter and myself. Kuth Lodron is the Welsh name for the thieves Warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You did not have to trust me. Thefter's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Let's make haste, then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. Hmm. 
This forest and all of Gloucestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is old magic here. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of reformation. Do you think that's why he was targeted? There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tevder's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch, open to wisdom from the gods. Have you seen anything? I see much smoke. Are there any rival Danes passing through who could have done it? If it were rival Danes, we would have heard their horns by now. We are not a humble sort. Blunt tongues and sharp axes. Kuthladrin, the Thieves' Warren. This is where I leave you. You'll find somewhere safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then meet me there. Gods old and new go with you. Let's see you, old friend. <laughs> this place is heavily guarded. Pick up our trail. Hold on. Picked up our trail. Hold on. It's Tender's voice. So he lives. Wheelim is hiding. Filthy. 
Get out my way, idiot! Oh shit is right. Eivor, you're alive. Have mercy. I were under orders. Elderman Coonan, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sales haunt you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice in scapegoat, Gwilym. And we thought that if we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Coonan for more coin to keep it secret. Why would Kunan pay to have Tefter killed? He is to be his successor. We ain't ones for details. The less we know, the better, yeah? You chose to extort the man, but have no basis for the crime. You're imbeciles. Look, we wasn't gonna kill the lad. We've come to like having him around. Tell him, tell him we've taken care of you. Kunan did this? Why? I've done nothing. T oh, gods, is he dead? Wake up, wake up. Tell the Dean I've hand fed you like a baby sparrow. Ah, move, fool. Ah. Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, had drinks together. Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue. Tafter will need to see a healer. The slot has been smearing dung on his face. But I've been held for ransom by worse men. Thank you for your aid, then. And try not to get held for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Help me! A good heart. Lord Jesus, Thank please you. help me! When I awoke in this demon lair, I feared the worst. Save your strength, Tefter. It's a long ride. Kunon. Thank you. He it is ordered my death. I don't understand. He's been like a father to me. I will ask him myself. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being just as we, living in kindness under the laws of many gods. One face, many faces, it matters not. We are all blessed to be alive in his glory. The scrape has changed you, Tefter. Changed me. Changed the dressings. He's hot to the touch, and his mind fades in and out, but he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? 
They claim to have been hired by Kunan. Kunan did this? I know not why, only that he gave them coin to dispose of Tefter. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevda to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunan. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer. But if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunan? I will reveal his sins. Let his people decide if he deserves an honorable death. The man tarnished your name and you would let him live? Shame for shame. Not even his guard will welcome him when I'm done. You are resolute then. Then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modern. And please, take care of Tefter. I must get to Kunan before the festival's end. See me, this will get messy. I must find Kunan before I'm spotted. The longhouse. Picked up our trail. Hold on. A word of clarity will slip through them. Eivor, finally, Tiri de Hwalid. Bridget, it is good to see you. Eivor, what has become of Tevder? Did you find your scarf? Uh, thank you. I have found Tefter alive and safe. I need to speak to Kun. Bridget! I found an abandoned bird nest in the rafters. I'm going to take it home to Mother. If you gaddle it, then the Babans will do it and all. I lay a god. It's you again! The Sowen Butcher! The Sowen Butcher? Never mind. Gwynedd, I'm looking for Kunan. Have you seen him? He's busy with the festival and shooed me away to Bridget. Would you like to see some magic I've been practicing? Can you show me to Kunan if I say yes? Just one trick and then I can show you around. Um, okay. So reach into this pouch. The number of stones you're holding is... three! Wonderful magic, Gwen. 
Now I really need to find Kunin. Definitely am, sir. Come on, let's go find him. They're at the church, ladies. They don't like the festival, but Mama says they come anyway to cluck cluck like hens. Do you want to see another trick? I can pull an acorn from your ear. I need to find Kunin. It's important. You're lost, butcher. It's Avor. Why is that woman? Have you seen Elderman Coonan? Oh, that unholy visage startled me. It's past sundown, so Coonan has retired to the church for prayer. I have business with him. Even if you have business with him, it will have to wait until the morning. Locked himself in, only Geva has the key. Would Geva let me in? She's been instructed not to. Not that I can see her following a task so simple. Girl'd forget her own head if it weren't attached. Thank you for your help. I will speak with Kunan tomorrow. The key is held by someone named Geva. I must find her. I can out drink it all right. Step up! You'll save for yourself! Have you seen Kunan? Hey, it's the Mary Ruid. Rhyme with me, Mary. Sorry, friend. I have other matters to attend to. You're no friendly spirit at all. I'm looking for Gloucester's elderman. <laughs> well, the one who still draws breath is in the church. How do I get in? You're not supposed to get in. No reason to enter that dump anyway. Fuck, you'd have to get me very drunk to show you inside. Sounds like some ale will loosen this town. Have you seen Kunan? Hey, it's the Mary Ruid. Rhyme with me, Mary Ruid. On so a night all out to fly, some to... F f f oh, oh, you've I messed up the rhyme. The man tries to rhyme with all his might. <laughs> Didn't take much to outwit me. <laughs> You're really good. Good enough for a reward. Many thanks. Enjoy the festival.
I would know more about you, Gwyneth. You are certainly an odd little bird. Mother says there'll be no one like me in the whole of creation. From the dawn of dust to the end of sorrows. Your mother trusts you. Let you run about on your own. She spends the holiday blessing hermits in old rocks. What fun is that? And your father, Gwyneth? Where is he? Well, it's not to be spoken of, but I was born from the union of my mother with the horned king of the forest, Genunos. You are close with Bridget? She's like a big sister. But it's not like I'm going to get to see her much anymore once she leaves with you and Gunnar. How do you spend your days, Gwyneth? Collecting dead things for Mama's spells. I have quite a collection. Birds, mice, um, beetles. And I dance. And I can talk to cats. I should find Kunan. Please, or Tevder and Govlim. My priority speed depends on Rachib. You harbor a personal grudge against the church. I hate this town more than I hate the building, or, Lord forbid, God himself. Damn kids here keep ruining my offerings in his glory. Picked up our trail. Hold on. Have you seen Kunan? <laughs> He's gonna be in the Wicker Man. <laughs> Have you seen Kunan? after the festival. I'm looking for Kunan. Right! Right, yes. He's in the church. Actually, if you're headed that way, this crate needs to be delivered to him. Just tell Geva I sent you. Of course. Um, what does Geva look like? Badger mask, same as me. 
should come running when she sees you. Best of luck, and happy sowing! Gebba's waiting for this delivery to the church. That's my way in. Good you came by. Sarah was supposed to drop it off ages ago. I would know more about you, Gwyneth. Mother. I should find Kunan. Kunan is inside. I must find a way to get in. You are snake tongue. Eivor! Hey, <laughs> have you have you been enjoying the festivities? We're done with this shadow play. Tefto's safe, and I know of your plan to sacrifice him in your stead. You think I mean to escape the flames? I go to the wicker man gladly, but I will not leave Glowerchester in the hands of the Christian zealot. Then what? Leave your people without a leader? In an angry church ready with holy fire? They won't be without a leader. Modron will sit upon the Horn's throne. Are you telling me that Modron lied? Ha! <laughs> We've turned you in circles like a dog, haven't we? Modron was the architect of Tevder's murder, Eivor. All to take control of Gloucestershire for herself. It would be a hard grasp to hold, surrounded by Christians on all sides. There was no other way. She had a vision. Tevder framed by flames and burning. Everything we created together. Everything? You and Motherin? Then... Gwyneth? A man must get his house in order before his death. Feather his nest for his children. You and the witch? This was the plan. To make me dance your merry tune, so you could build a legacy for your daughter. I always desired Modron. So when she asked me to take the part in a fertility ritual, of course I agreed. Our union conceived not only Gwenev, but a united Glowichestershire. One that Tevder would stamp out. This is where you fail, Kunin. Tevder is a changed man. He straddles the same line as you. Tevder? The boy has the head of a mule. You taught him reason? Not just I. The kindness of bandits and strange Britons. He embraces Christ and churning us alike. Shit. Prophecy is a strange web, is it not? Tevder's reformation just needed a kidnapping and a dedicated Dane. Eivor, Modron will have taken Tevder to her forest temple. If you make haste, you might be able to stay her blade. I have much to attend to here, otherwise I'd lead you myself. Go now. <laughs> Unless you plan on killing me first. You are already a dead man. I will not make your people suffer for your actions. Thank you, Eivor. Your mercy will be rewarded. I'm sure.